Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, Be in the Violin. Um, <clears throat> so today we are going to talk about contact point. And contact point on the violin when we play, like you know, we have this space, right? Like right here. So there are actually uh, five of them. Um, so the one that is close to the fingerboard, right, or on top of the fingerboard. Like this around this area. And then the second one is like right next to closer. The middle one is the one that we use a lot. And then the one that is closer to the bridge. And the one is right next to the bridge. And each of these will have different um, sound depending on like the weight and the speed of the bow. So the reason why we, we actually like learned about this is because whenever we press a string, so right now, for example, if I play the, the, um, the A in the middle, right? So like, you know, I get beautiful sound. So if I um, hit the third finger on the A string, okay, I still get a good, good sound, right? But how about if I move it a little further to closer to the bridge? I get a little more resonant, more like, you know. So basically, if you play closer to the fingerboard, the sound will get a little softer. And then when you're closer to the bridge, um, you get a little more resonant sound and louder. So you can try this. Um, just play this open string across the finger, uh, across the, like, you know, the contact point area. And the reason is this. So whenever we shift, for example, if I shift down to the third position, so when we when we hit the um, the note on the on the um, on the string, the string gets shortened, right? Because like so, instead of having the whole length of the string. When we shift or when we hit, hit the note, um, the string gets shortened. And that's why we have to move our, like, you know, um, contact point to, to get the best sound within that area. So if I am playing on the third, in the third position, at the middle, the sound is okay. It's a little um, like raspy, right? But if I move it to closer to the bridge, I, it gets fuller sound. So depending on the effect that you are looking for, if you want like good sound, then like you know, the middle seems to be fine, but some people likes to play closer to the bridge because um, they want to be heard, right? So, you know, that's why I said, depending on where you want to play. Um, so experiment with uh, with a contact point um, and, you know, have fun with it. Um, and, you know, you will, you will find the optimal spot of where to play um, which notes to get the best sound. So experiment with it and let me know what you think. Um, thank you so much for um, watching and I will see you next time. Um, please subscribe to the channel, that'd be great. Bye.